Welcome to the Lenovo Legion Savage Skills Series. My name is Jimmy Broadbent. I'm a content creator, uh, part-time racing driver and sim racer. But today, I'm gonna to be a very scuffed stuntman. So we're here at M Sport, just outside the Lake District. And if you know M Sport, you'll know they're famous for one thing, and that's rallying. And we thought to celebrate the launch of this Lenovo Legion 7 gaming laptop, we're gonna do this awesome sim racing rally I'm going to be sitting alongside a very talented driver, Frank Bird, who actually currently drives an M Sport prepared for Fiesta Rally 2 car. So quite a lot of experience in the car we're going to be in. And whilst he's doing his best to make me throw up as his passenger, I will be attempting to set my own lap time in Forza Horizon 5 uh, for you guys to beat a bit later on. And of course, the star of the show, the Legion 7 gaming laptop, made of magnesium and aluminium, 16 inches, which is the resolution of 2560 by 1600. Now that means for you guys, that's more usable space. So this is the Legion True Strike Pro. It actually has a slightly further travel in the keys to give you that sort of mechanical keyboard style feel. It offers RGB powered by Legion Spectrum, so you can look flashy while you're being flashy. The Legion 7 also has cold front 4.0 and vapor chamber technology. It's got next gen cooling tech, which includes 20% more powerful fan systems than the last gen, which gives you nice, lovely, crisp frame rates and up to 32 gigs of DDR5 memory. The Legion 7 comes with both the latest Intel and AMD variants. And for graphics card, exactly the same story. You can have the latest Nvidia GeForce graphics cards, as well as the latest AMD Radeon. It also comes with three months of PC Game Pass, and that's over 100 top quality games, including Forza, which we'll be using today. So what is sim racing? The best way I would describe it is having a fake racing car in your bedroom at home, a way to race online virtually without the risk or massive cost of real life racing. The standout feature of this Legion 7 is that we can use it pretty much anywhere. I, I think that if it, if it holds up inside a rally car, it's gonna hold up literally anywhere. So you're strapped into this car, you're feeling every vibration, all the noise, and those things can be fairly distracting. So I've got to try and pretend that's not happening, try and just get on with the task I've got. If I can set a decent time, in, in Forza whilst going through what I think is probably the most distracting conditions possible. I think that, um, you know, I, I can call myself a decent sim racer. Well, sh <laughs> I don't know, I expect it to be fairly quick launching, but I like the noise of it was just insane. It just disappears, it's gone. Up around the corner. Yeah, just massive trail of like dirt and dust behind it. I'm Frank Bird, I'm 22 and I'm from Penrith, which is just down the road. This is my local trail really, so um, yeah, Jimmy's in good hands hopefully. Uh, I started racing when I was young, my dad used to be a rally driver, I've done a few rallies around here at Greystoke Forest and Luckily, I've won them, so um, Jimmy's going to try and play his game next to me. There's going to be a lot of different things thrown at him, different uh, G-forces on his body and stuff like that. So um, for me, I've got the easy job, really. I've just got to get round. It's, it's Jimmy, really. He's got a bit of a challenge on his hands. It's going to be easy, mate. No challenge at all. Easy.
hard to see. You can see like how sweaty I am. But you're holding on to the wheel, trying to keep yourself propped up. At the same time, your eyes don't don't adjust to how you're looking at the screen. So whenever Frank hits a bump or goes around a corner, yeah, your vision goes blurry. So I think it's all right, regardless. Um, I didn't beat him round, but um, you know. So, uh, I'm not sure there's anyone that can say to me they could have done better than that. <laughs> I mean, I'm feeling all right. It was a bit more difficult than I thought it would be. I think I went in with a bit, bit of bravado, being like, oh, yes, I'm going to be fine at this. But it turns out when you're being flung about um, and <laughs> G-force all over the place, it's quite hard to concentrate. But uh, I've, as I said, I think we, we did fairly well with it. And uh, I'm actually fairly impressed how the laptop held up because I was part of me thinking that nah, it's ain't gonna, ain't gonna work, but it was flawless the entire time. Uh, so my lap time was a 127 dead, which is quite a bit slower than I did earlier on. So I, I think the uh, really feeling the effects of the G-Force and getting thrown around, but uh, I think it was all right nonetheless. So yeah, the, the Legion 7 did really well. Um, I think that if it can survive being thrown around by a madman in a Fiesta rally car, then it can pretty much survive anything, play anywhere. I don't think there's anything this thing can do. So my lap time in car was a 127.0, but if you're really up for a challenge, my normal lap time was a 115.7. So it's over to you guys now to try and beat it.